As engineers, we tend to fix everything ourselves. My garage is filled with tools for fixing my bike, my car, my plumbing, my ham radio tower. I could save endless time and frustration by just paying a professional to fix things. But I don't. Why? Because I'm a control freak cursed with an ungodly craving for knowledge and power. Also, nobody touches my things. But sometimes, I fear that this craving is infiltrating my work. And you can see it in some of the software we write. Oh, we need an XML parser? Let me just whip out one on my own using my favorite language du jour. Forget that pre-packaged, pre-tested library. It's heavyweight. Now excuse me while my brain invents reasons why that's not a horrible mistake. Ah, much better. I think as engineers, we often have to fight the urge to control everything. We have to relinquish a little bit of power to the engineers that came before us who have solved problems so that we can solve bigger, newer problems. Let's not get hung up on reinventing things we shouldn't. Here are some things that don't need reinventing. Razor blades. Shaving works the same way it always has, and nothing improves it if you just slap on another blade. Screwdriver heads. Phillips, flathead, and Torx should be enough. Hex in both English and metric? That's overkill. And I don't want to name names, but if you invent your own screw head just to annoy me, you know who you are. You know what you can reinvent? Cell phone service. My smartphone sometimes sounds like two tin cans connected by a long string. I want 4G. Real 4G, not marketing 4G. So engineers, please stay focused on the important engineering problems. Because I won't be happy until I have more G's in my cell phone service than I have blades in my razor. My name is Malcolm, and that's what's on my engineering mind.